Hey everyone, welcome back to Living by the F Word. In today's video, I'm gonna be talking about my step fitness equipment. I'm gonna be unboxing it. I'm also gonna be starting a new fitness journey. So I'm going to be weighing myself, taking some measurements, and just kind of showing you why I got this system so I could work out from home. What's up everyone? Welcome back. Really happy to be finally getting this video done because I've had my equipment for a couple weeks now and it took about three weeks to get here. So I'm really excited to show it to you. I finally got to unbox it and set it up. And in this video, I'm not gonna be going too far into the types of workouts you can do with this equipment. I will touch upon it a little bit, but really I just kind of want to start the fitness journey with kind of vlogging, me weighing myself, you know, getting measurements, basic things like that, and then just showing you the equipment and the versatility with it. So let's go. Welcome back to the studio. I am finally going to unbox my gym equipment and set up a little area so that this can be my little at home gym. Woohoo! because I'm not trying to move my camera around a million ways although I probably will take it off and do a little bit closer up for you but basically I have finally set my equipment up and I just want to show you what comes with the uh, package that I got all right so my camera is kind of at a strange angle I have it on a tripod and I will show you some closer ups but just so that I can talk to you guys I'm gonna sit here so I got the deluxe barbell set and if you go on to the step.com, they do have combo at home packages. And the reason why I went with the barbell versus the dumbbell set is because I frequently use the plates just freestyle anyway, meaning like I will just, and I'll show you an example. I will just, you know, press these with my hole with my hole with my hand in the hole <laughs> sounds terrible but that's how you use them um you can grip them like this so you can still do free style lifting with these plates you don't necessarily need to have a smaller dumbbell bar so i felt like i also got the most weights with this package because the barbell comes with two large plates two medium plates two small plates and two extra small plates so i could really really stack the weight onto this a lot if i want it super heavy once i start getting into my groove and, and getting better with the lifting i can definitely load this up heavy and do a lot of different things with it it's a 54 inch bar there's the two quick release collars so this is basically and i'll show you a close-up but this is how you basically lock the plates in place you have like i said the different size plates so the large one is 5 kg it's 11 pounds one of these is 11 pounds um the medium plates are 8.25 pounds or 3.75 kg the smaller ones are 5.5 pounds or 2.5 kg 
and the extra smalls, which I never really use that much, but can definitely probably use them now is 2.75 pounds or 1.25 kg. So the good thing about these is like, you can grab these plates from the handle. You can do, um, you could squat with them. You can do, you know, extensions. You could do kickbacks. You could do a lot of things with these plates without them having to be on a dumbbell bar. Meanwhile, you could squat, do lunges, do all different types of things with the bar loaded up. So that's why I went with this. And then I got the step and it comes with two risers. I got, I bought two extra risers as well because I'm tall. And honestly, this, I usually, I used to, when I was at the gym, I would rise these up really high. I would use probably about like four to six risers on each side, but I was already spending a decent amount of money. And so I just went with this and it does feel a little low for me. So it's going to work for now. It's better than nothing, but I'm definitely happy that I have this like workbench so I could do tricep pre uh, presses. I could do chest presses, really a lot of different things. You can put this bench on an incline because of how these are cut out. You just have so many different options with this, but let me tell you the prices. It was, let's see. So they have at home bundle workouts. So I got the bundle B, which would be the universal step with the deluxe barbell set. And it's saying it's $299.99, but I feel like I didn't pay that. So let me go and check. Let me check my receipts. I feel like the price changed. Okay, so I paid for this at home workout bundle $250 plus I got the two extra step blocks for $30, which was a total of $280. And then I, I do believe that there, I think it was shipping was included because they ship within the US. And so I think shipping was already included. So I only paid $280 for all this and now the price seemed to have gone up since I ordered it back in June to about $300. Do I think it's worth it? Um, yes, if you're disciplined and can work out at home, I definitely think it's worth it. The reason why I had to do this was because there's no way I could afford my gym membership if I'm getting furloughed, which I am gonna be getting furloughed if the CARES Act doesn't pass. So basically I'm planning on getting furloughed from a company. I can't be spending $90 on a gym membership. I go to a really nice gym that is like a spa style gym and I can't be spending that type of money monthly when I'm unemployed. Hey everyone, welcome to my room. I am going to start this fitness journey. I've been there before, I'm doing it again. So today I am weighing myself, taking some measurements, just so I could see my progress now that I finally have fitness equipment in my home. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. smaller bra only because 
it was a bra I wore when I lost a lot of weight and so I just want to kind of track my progress that way since I know it's a smaller bra you could see them kind of popping out over here um, and the back fat you could see in the back um, just because it's super it's super like kind of cut in and um, yeah like I mean you could even tell my boobs are pretty heavy and full of fat so um, yeah, that's why I'm wearing this, just uh, for some progress. And then I'm just wearing, like, some biker shorts for right now. But eventually I'll probably put, like, low-cut underwear on just so I could see my progress, like, in pictures. But let's keep this YouTube-friendly, shall we? wanted to share my starting experience at least with you because I also want to keep track of it for myself to see my progress and how long it takes me to get back to where I want to be with my body um, but yeah basically really simple to set up and I have these like little foam things that I got from home goods actually these foam things that I have on the floor with my yoga mat on top of it we got because we got a blow up kiddie pool for our backyard and we put it underneath the pool so that it would be squishy. So now I just have my yoga mat and stuff. So if I decide I want to do, you know, you could do a lot of things with the step. Honestly, so much you can do with this system. And that's what I hope to show you in some other videos so that you could see like the benefits of having this tiny little, you know, setup because there, there really are a lot of possibilities. Oh my God, I hope all this is recording because like I literally have my thing so ghetto rigged right now with my microphone and this light because it's so dark in here. It's like super cloudy. So <laughs> hope uh, I can keep up with this little vlog series of my fitness journey. And I just wanted to show you guys cause I'm super excited to start working out and lifting again. If you like content like this, make sure you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you aren't subscribed already. And yeah, I'm looking forward to documenting some fitness on my channel for you. See you in the next video. Peace.